Welcome back everyone, I'm Mr. Grimms and we're continuing on with the Rogue Legacy. We're gonna head on to the second boss. Before we move on though, you may notice some things are different. I'm level 30, have a new sword, and the map, I'll show you in a bit, is completely discombobulated. It's because I've, I've accidentally entered the castle when uh, I forgot to lock it. And I didn't lock it and it reset the entire thing so I just had to make my way to the second boss as fast as possible <clears throat> so that way we can uh, start it up again so let's go ahead and do it should be a little bit easier but I'm not gonna assume that he's gonna do no damage to me because he is one powerful mother of a flame ball all right so just want to kite him around the room as much as possible ah crap I didn't mean to hover there. Alright. Crap. There we go. Okay, so he's almost at half health. Oh, jeez. Oh no, I didn't even see that there! Ah, oh, damn it! Not again. Okay. Oh no! Ah, oh, Jesus. Bring it on, Ponce de Leon. Whoa. Oh my god. I do not want to get fancy here. Yes, we got it. We did it. Give me your money. Oh, sweet. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Well, that boss proved to be one hell of a challenge. It was more of a endurance round. See how much you can dodge and hit at the same time. Um, but as, as I was saying before, the hardest about that is just the spike balls. Not really the flames since you can tie them around. It's just those things that can mess up your pattern. What do we have today? HP, magic, and strength. Awesome. And that completely renders the second boss dead all right so i think that's a perfect place to cut it because that took me oh my god that that boss gave me so much problems but obviously you need to get prepared i wasn't prepared i think i was trying to kill him at like level 24 i think and i was utterly failing it was just sad it was really stupid but when i got to level 30 i had one hell of a chance so that's great so as always thank you so much for watching this 
I hope, uh, I bet one of you guys came up with a better way to kill that boss. If you guys did, send me a comment below. It'd be much appreciated. I'm always fighting, trying to find new ways to take down these bosses and this whole castle since this game is notoriously hard. And as always, I will see you guys in the next Rogue Legacy video. Take care, guys.